This is a case of meal kit supply, two course MREs. Now each case contains six rations, which break down to three separate menus. It's like a mini case of lightweight MREs. All right, so let's give it a look. Oh, they taped it shut too. All right, so there you go. Check those out. Menu number one, spaghetti with meat and sauce. So you get two of each menu. You get a second spaghetti. Then cheese tortellini, menu number two. And they give you the actual menu lineup right on the front of the pack. And also, you got your nutrition facts breakdown. This is like a, a true civilian ration in that sense. And then your third menu is beef ravioli and meat sauce. So if you ever wondered what's inside one of these cases, that is what you get in one of those cases. You get six lightweight MREs. That case totals out to approximately 3,600 calories. All right, menu number one, spaghetti with meat and sauce. Nice, easy tear notch right there. It's double sealed. So right off the bat here, our main course, spaghetti with beef and sauce. A strawberry toaster pastry. Carbohydrate, electrolyte, beverage base, grape. We got a spoon and napkin. And then your flameless ration heater. So that's looking pretty good. All right, so let's get this out on your tray. Nice, okay, so let's first start off with that spaghetti with beef and sauce. Throw it in the separate H. We'll see how responsive this famous ration heater is. Feels like it really is actually. Oh, that's getting hot already. Nice. While that's doing its thing, we're gonna check out this grape drink. That just smells very tart and strong. Now that strawberry pop tart. It smells nice and fresh. A little bit crumbly, but that's okay. There you go. All right, let's see if this is heated up now. has a nice, kind of almost homemade smell to it. Like, and I can pick up some Parmesan cheese. Oh yeah. That just looks awesome right there.
Mm. Yeah, there's a reason why spaghetti's been one of the original menus. There's only two menus that have been in the MRE menu lineup since 1981, and this is one of them. Beef stew is the other. That is a perfect main course. The tomato sauce, it's not overly acidic, but it still has flavor. Little pieces of ground beef, they don't seem overly processed. And there's a Parmesan cheese in it. You can't go wrong with spaghetti. Especially MRE spaghetti. I mean, this lightweight MRE, I think it does have its purpose. I think it's perfect for kids. I mean, like, everything in this. Three red sauce mains, Pop-Tarts, and Gatorade, essentially. I mean, like, it'd be great for a kid on, like, you know, summer camp or something like that. Even for your emergency supply. Say if you, you were limited on space, this would be great. Or if you just wanted to be on a budget. Haven't tried the grape drink yet. Yeah, it just really has a almost indistinguishable fruit flavor. I wouldn't even have known it was grape except that it says it on the pack. I suppose it would be useful if you want to stow a few of these away in like your vehicle or something. They're significantly less bulky than a standard MRE. You go for this Pop-Tart. Yeah, the Pop-Tarts, I mean like, again, perfect if you got kids or... Yeah, this spaghetti's awesome. The noodles, they're not mushy. The ground beef, it has great flavor. You don't need to add any seasonings or anything like that to this. It's good right off the go. How it tied me over for at least a few hours. That was a, a nice little meal. All right, and we're back with menu number two, cheese tortellini. All right, so right off the bat here, we got cheese tortellini and tomato sauce. Got a frosted brown sugar cinnamon toaster pastry. FRH, our flameless ration heater. Carbohydrate electrolyte beverage base, lemon lime. And then a spoon. That's looking pretty good. All right, so let's get this out on your tray. Nice, okay, so let's first start off with that cheese tortellini and tomato sauce. Oh, that's working nice and fast. Wow, that Pop-Tart doesn't have the little Pop-Tart brand foil. It's just a nice, subtle brown sugar and light shortening smell. Nothing too special. You know, while the FRH is doing its thing, I feel like that's your best time to just go ahead and eat the Pop-Tart. You know, when they say two course, you're waiting for the, the main course to heat up. And if you never had a brown sugar cinnamon Pop-Tart, it's just like a, a light shortening, brown sugar filling pastry. It's very generic, very simple and straightforward. I don't even think I mentioned what the strawberry Pop-Tart tasted like. I actually kind of almost tasted like nothing with like a slight cardboard fruit flavor. This right here, world's better. Definite step above the strawberry. Again, I don't really see where it fits for the main course, but I guess it doesn't. You know, it's a two course meal. 
I think you're supposed to eat them separately. This is pretty much a restricted calorie MRE. A restricted calorie 24 hour portion, three meals per day, 1800 calories. Actually, that's, that's more than what a lot of people have in a day. But say if you eat 3000 calories per day on average, 1800, that'll tide you along for weeks without any real major reduction in your physical performance. Lemon lime, that is so much more of a real and notable flavor. I mean, it actually tastes like lime. All right, so let's check out that main course. Oh, that thing is perfectly heated. Check out those tortellinis. Hmm, that's very subtle. The cheese isn't very notable. Wow, you would hardly need teeth to eat this, that's for sure. The tomato sauce, it's not like too watery of a sauce, it's kind of thick. The cheese inside the tortellini, it's a nice filling. It's a real one size fits all kind of meal. It really is, anyone can eat this. It's vegetarian, it's really filling, I'll give it that. It seems like a, a slight basil and oregano and a little bit of black pepper. Even that, very, very subtle. You know, that was a pretty good meal. It'll hold me for probably about three to four hours. All right, and with menu number three, okay, so right off the bat, we got the, that main course. Beef ravioli and meat sauce. That's a staple MRE main course. You got a chocolate chip toaster pastry. FRH, famous ration heater. Spoon and napkin. Carbohydrate electrolyte beverage powder, orange. And then that little cardboard sleeve. All right, so let's get this out on your tray. Nice, okay. So then the beef ravioli and meat sauce. So then the orange beverage base. Just a nice, tangy, somewhat generic, artificial orange. So then that chocolate chip toaster pastry. Check that thing out. Mm. Yep, more moisture content. It was less dry, more flavor. That chocolate filling really just tastes like a s'mores without the marshmallow. Mm. It's sweet, but it's not overly sweet. And it just seems like there's a lot more to it overall than the last two Pop-Tarts. In my opinion, it's by far the best. That tastes pretty much just like Orange Gatorade or Orange Powerade. I think it's better than the beverage base that has that 80% vitamin C, but then no electrolytes. 
Oh yeah, this is this is definitely ready. Nice and hot. Not bad. I want to check this out. See what it looks like on the inside. Not much in there. There's a little bit of beef. I think there's more beef in the sauce than there probably is inside the ravioli, but hmm. The pasta itself, it's not too soft. That cheese tortellini, that was soft. It barely required chewing. This here, this has a lot more to it, texture-wise. A satisfying ground beef. Yeah, this is, to me, second best out of the three mains. The sauce, it has more flavor. I think there's a higher sodium content than the cheese tortellini. The ground beef is, hmm. Yeah, it's really good quality. I mean, it's like, it doesn't taste overly processed. Now the meat inside of the ravioli, the beef, that's very processed. That's almost like a sausage. And you can't really taste it. It just gives a little bit of texture, if anything, like a little bit of a chew. It still doesn't have the flavor dynamic of, say, the spaghetti. That spaghetti is like a masterpiece. So these were meal kit supply, two course MREs. Well, anyway, this is Steve1989 off MRE Info. Hope you liked the video. And I'll be coming back at you with something new. Or old. Alright, cool. See ya.